Hi everyone. So recently I have made a review for a crawler made by Oster Hobby, which also has um, the possibility to put a trailer at the back. Unfortunately, I did not get the trailer in time for the review, so I will make an extra review just for the trailer together with the crawler. Enjoy. So in this box, we get the trailer that is designed to fit on this crawler. The trailer hitch is already installed. And now let's check what's inside the box. Ooh, some assembly required. Now let's have a look at those tires first. They appear to be quite soft and grippy, and they are also beadlocks as it seems. And of course there's two of them. We will have them fitted later. In the back we have some lights and the parts that we need to assemble and also a spare trailer hitch. The boxes seem kind of cool, but we'll have a closer look at them later. I think first we will have to attach the tires. Ooh, and there's magnets in there. Okay, <laughs> attaching tires. One. And done. And now for the second one. There, oops. And for the second one. All right, looking good so far. Now we have to attach the lights, which for the bigger ones, you just pop them in and they stay attached. But the smaller ones, you should think about using some glue. Ah, and now to those boxes and also let's have a look at those magnets because they actually have a function. You can put them underneath any of those boxes so that when you put them in front of the trailer, they stay attached and won't fall off. And of course, the other magnets have to go here, but make sure that you put them in the correct way, otherwise they won't stick to each other. And plop. So with that done, we can actually attach the trailer. You just pop it onto the trailer hitch. It's a bit fidgety, but it's quite strong when it's actually attached. And you will not lose it that easy. So let's pretend we're going on a research. So we need our bow for protection. And we need some measures. This cool camera. And this magnifying glass, which does magnify stuff. And this little axe. A cup. A machete. And a RC card to play around with. Oh, doesn't seem to fit. Oh no, I think we have to repack again. Yeah, definitely have to take stuff out. Okay, this goes out. Ah, yes, that fits. Close the rest of the boxes and off we go. Oh yeah, the camera, we should not forget it. And magnifying glass and cup and let's go. And it does look really, 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 really cool. So it's the first time ever having a trailer on my crawler. So I'm kind of excited and interested to see what happens and how it drives with a trailer. And I must say it's kind of cool, but this is of course just a mostly flat and soft terrain so let's have it tested
I gotta say, this is a great addition to this crawler from Oster Hobby. The boxes on the trailer stay very well in place, you have to really want to lose them. This trailer might also fit on other 118 scale crawlers. I will put a link in the description. If you did like the video, give it a like and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Thank you for watching.